IU School of Medicine's mission involves three major areas. We care very deeply about educating the next generation of healers. It is part of our mission to create new information and knowledge uh, so that we can discover better ways to take care of our patients. And that indeed is our third mission of provision of outstanding patient care. When one thinks about learning in medical school, the first thing that people jump to is the curriculum. The definition of what it is we believe students should learn. A critically important part of learning is the environment and the context in which people learn. So we make sure that they're supported by a team of individuals who advise them and counsel them and support them through this process. I believe that their learning is better as a result. I used to go out right away, not only because it's close to home, but also because the physicians that I've talked to and the experiences that I've had during undergrad working as an EMT has really consolidated that idea that I use a great place to learn. It's a great place to not only learn um, medicine, but also just learn as a professional and how to be a good person. And I've really been surrounded by people who have supported me and want to help me. I can tell you for a fact I would not be here without the mentoring and support that I've received thus far um, throughout my time here at IU School of Medicine. I am forever grateful for all of their help and support, knowing that there are people there that have gone through it and also are willing to help you through it, um, independent of whatever your own struggles may be, is super important and has been invaluable while I've been here. IU has been really supportive in like the second I opened my mouth and said I wanted to be a dermatologist, they've connected me with people who have experience in the field. Um, I reached out and requested a career mentor and they matched me with someone who um, has been helping me um, work on a research project and like I was able to shadow over the summer and um, I'm working with a resident now who's also um, interested in working on the same research I am and it's just been great. I mean, I. I guess dermatology is like a notoriously difficult specialty to match into, but I haven't felt like I would be left out for any reason. I feel very comfortable going into residency because of the support that I've been provided at the IU School of Medicine. The clerkship experience is phenomenal. I personally have gotten a lot of exposures, not only on the Indianapolis campus, but across the state from a lot of different surgeons and different doctors and various specialties that have actually served as mentors for me that have allowed me to have a lot of ownership. And it, the whole, the, a lot of the hospital systems allow you to get a different exposure to a diversity of patients as well that will really make sure you're able to find the passion and medicine that's meant for you. For me, the biggest program of benefit was the, the scholarly concentration. I personally chose the business scholarly concentration because it allowed me to dabble into business that, in aspects that I would not have otherwise been able to. And that has actually allowed me to full on pursue my MBA and I'll be graduating in the spring with my MD MBA. At IU School of Medicine, our emphasis on exposure of our students to research and new technologies is really at the top of our strategic plan. We simply harness the great work that's going on across IU School of Medicine and all of our clinical partners throughout the state of Indiana. Um, we're proud to say that we've got excellent opportunities for them to train and to see these new technologies play out to provide better care and better health for the state of Indiana. The POGUS curriculum is actually really interesting. And before medical school, I began seeing ultrasound being used by many of the nurses in the emergency room, and I always had interest in it. And it looks easier than it is, and I think uh, IU School of Medicine providing the opportunity to students to practice early, very interesting, is also very beneficial as well. When I told my dad that we were working with ultrasound at such an early stage, like this was first year and within the first few months, um, he was like, I didn't touch an ultrasound probe until I was a resident. You don't realize like how, um, how really cutting edge it is and how actually helpful it will be learning the actual sensitivity and specificity of the tool has been really helpful. At IU School of Medicine, diversity, equity, inclusion, and justice have been a priority since our inception. What we've done to adjust and really drive home the point uh, of those different areas is to develop the Achieving Inclusivity in Medicine program that starts at the beginning of our orientation program with our first year students. What we've noticed so far is that it has made a difference, that our 
Um, students are able to interact with one another, even though they're coming from all parts of the United States, and work together to help each other learn. Being able to have that community, that support system, that network of people that are not only like-minded, but also truly have the same end goal and um, desire to you know, help others as their main goal and their main drivers. Kind of having that support, you know, through thick and thin is invaluable because we can't do things alone and being able to do stuff together and as a cohesive team is the essence of medicine. Why am I excited about IU School of Medicine and our future? It's because of the students we continue to attract as well as the faculty to help train them and push back the frontiers of science, but also about the training aspects of our nine campus system. Each and every one of these communities has unique characteristics in terms of their areas of emphasis, in terms of medical research, medical study, and the populations that they serve. We actually have a 10th campus, and that's in Eldoret, Kenya. All those things make me excited about the future of IU School of Medicine, and I, I think we have a tremendous platform on which to train our students. IU School of Medicine is on an upward trajectory constantly. We're on an upward trajectory in our research. If you take a look at our research funding over the last number of years, it has increased remarkably. We are on an upward trajectory in the care that our faculty provide to patients. And in addition, we are on an upward trajectory in the quality of our medical education program and the opportunities that we offer to our students. This accreditation process serves the school well in helping to accelerate that upward trajectory in our medical education program to assure that we are doing medical education the very best that we can do it as we at IU School of Medicine are preparing healers and transforming health.